I'm talking, I'm in a store, and I'm talking. Yes, hello. In the next two weeks, if that's possible. I just have an upcoming surgery coming up, so I won't be able to for a few, for a while after that. Uh, September 1st. Thank you, bye. Did I hear you right? You wanted to serve on the board of a scholarship committee? A scholarship that Chuck never in a million years would have given to Jimmy. Never! It is just, I mean, oh, what's this too, huh, Howard? What's in this? One last screw you, little brother, from beyond the grave? Am I really supposed to do this to him? All right, Kim. What can I do to make it better? Nothing. What did, what did you call them? Dinner? Mascarpone? in an impulsive, destructive, chaotic way that was unpredictable, but somehow also felt so right. the summer built on night treks of going out every single night to feed under the light of the moon instead of the vitamins of the sun whether it was for work or due to the extreme heat here we are every night walking these same streets and there she is looking down It's okay to be stupid and angry about some things. Like you don't always have to like prevent feelings of like being angry and stupid. Like sometimes you're just angry and stupid because that's how your brain works. So it's like, why would you feel shitty about being angry and stupid? Like you're gonna do it again because you're stupid. You'll be angry again because you're, you're dumb. That's what you are as a human. And, like, not just you, but, like, every other person on the planet is also dumb and stupid, so... 
Um, just be angry about things that don't matter. Or be happy about things that don't matter. It's whatever. <laughs> Things got fucked up for a while, and when things get fucked up, it's always very frustrating, and it's always very hard to fix. Look out on a summer's day, with eyes that know the darkness in my soul, shadows on the hills, sketch the trees and the daffodils, catch the breeze and the winter chill. In colors on the snowy linen land Now I understand What you tried to say to me And how you suffered for your sanity And how you tried to set them free They would not listen, they did not know Perhaps they'll listen now. It's a week away now, and I don't know what else to say other than that. Maybe it will happen, and maybe it won't. And that's about all the words that I have for right now. I cannot control my feelings and really take that in on a deeper level and understand it as a statement that is true. I'm gonna feel anxious. I'm gonna feel scared. I feel scared and anxious right now as we speak. We go rolling on one. But as people have told me for countless years, as if I've said to myself for countless years, years but it's never really sunk in, is that I can only affect what I do. And that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna fucking do. COVID test, definitely not that bad, just felt ticklish. I was fully prepared to go in there and just be lobotomized, but that did not happen. 